guys, it's Kat. I have a haul for, to share with you today. Um, I ordered a few things off of the Two Peas message forum and uh, something I ordered this little punch off of Yard Seller to use with the Stampin' Up. I think I showed these two in another video. They're Stampin' Up Pewter Little Brad. It's like a Brad maker. Let me open it and I'll show it to you. And you punch out a little hole of paper and then you put it on the brad and then you put one of these little doohickeys on top of it and then you've made your own brad so I needed to punch the right size and I finally found one so I ordered that off yard seller and I got it for a dollar because I had credits with those photons or photo ons or whatever that is um, that they give you so I did that and then on the two piece message form there's a lady whose husband has a laser what is it called I forget what it's called, but it's like a wood cutting laser thing. And she makes, or he makes custom wood veneer shapes. And I ordered some from her. And she made me this cute little card. And her name is Diana. And if you're interested in getting these, just go to the Two Peas Message Forum, the For Sale or Trade Board. And there's a post that says Custom Wood Veneer Shapes. And that's where you can get them. So I'll show you what I got. And they're, they're priced really well. They're 10 cents a piece. And I got 20 of each of the things that I ordered. So I ordered the little potty people. So there's 20 of each in there. Or like 10 of these and 10 of these, you know. And then I ordered some stars. And with the stars, I also ordered the outline. Like, here's the inside of the stars. Let me zoom in so you can see a little better. So here's the inside of the stars, and like only one side of the wood has wood grain on it. I'm not sure what kind of wood this is, but um, it's not, it's nice and thin. See how thin it is? So it won't take up any room on your cards or your pages. But So I got the cards, and then I also got the outline of the stars. Did I say cards? I meant stars. Um, oh, here's some more potty people. She must have thrown these in because, oh no, these are the women, and these are the men. Okay. And then there's another package of men. Okay, so there's the stars. And then I also got, if I can get it out, these little ampersands. How cute is that? Aren't those cute? And they're like the size of my finger. Don't mind my black thumb. I've been playing with Mr. Huey's and Lindy's for a couple days and I can't get it off. And there's some more little people. And then I ordered these little asterisks, which, uh, they're not as cute in person as they were on the internet. They don't really have a wood grain to them, if you can look. It's just kind of, well, I guess it does, but it's really light. But I don't really, I don't really care for those, but I like all the others. They're really cute. And then she sent me some freebies. She sent me this bird cage, which is really cute. It's really well done. I'm just not into bird cages very much. But she sent me this, this which I love, because I have dogs. This little dog house with the paw prints. How cute is that? And then there's a little fan. And some cherries. And this thing. Bird flourish thing. It's so intricate. Okay, so that's all I got from there. And then I'll be back with the rest of my haul in just a second. I gotta charge my battery. Okay, so I'm back and I've got another haul to share with you from Two Peas in a Bucket. And... I ordered just a couple of papers. First I got these sticky keys, the denim and cream sticky keys from October Afternoon. And I got the 9 to 5 word stickers. And this is what they look like. I also got the 9 to 5 label stickers. I don't have the collection because I don't have anything like office related to scrapbook. But I just, I love these um, label stickers and word stickers. And I figured I could find a way to use those. Then I also got the Orange and Cream Mini Market stickers because I must have them in every color. <laughs> so I bought those. And then I got a couple of papers. I bought um, a bunch of these boardroom pages from the 9 to 5 collection. And this is one side. I bought them all for this wood grain. And then the other side, I don't really care for. It's this pattern. Um, 
And then from Echo Park Sweet Day, I bought two of these sheets, and this is called Delightful. So it's like a yellow gingham. And if you look closely, it's textured. See the texture? Or it looks textured, it's not really textured. And then this is the side that I bought it for. And then from the same collection, I got Lovely Chevron. So it's got these little X's on one side and the Chevron on the other. Then I got two of the journaling cards because I love these doilies. So I got it really for this side. But I bought two just in case I wanted to use these. And if I don't use these, I can definitely use both sides of this. And then I just got a couple of pages of the cardstock. So this one is blue and yellow, or dark teal and yellow, but it's not dark. And it looks textured too, see? And then this one is pink and red. It doesn't really look red though, it looks like more like a melon. And this looks more like a peach, it doesn't really look like pink. So those are the papers that I got, and the stickers. And then I ordered, of course, some thickers. So I bought Eric foam letter stickers, and they're this really pretty green color. Wonder in this blue-green color. I love this font, and they're so little, they're perfect. And then I also bought um, the Wonder in this green. And then I got Rockabye in fabric chipboard. I like the texture on the fabric. And then Doll in this green. So those are the thickers that I got. And then I bought some Mr. Hueys. I have one package, of Miss, or one, not package, one bottle of Mr. Hueys, and it's the Inky Black. And I liked it so much that I started buying the regular, I mean the other colors. So I ordered these from Two Peas, and then yesterday, Joann's is having a 50, I think it's 50% off right now, and their Mr. Hueys is like $2.99. So I ordered the rest of the colors that they had. So today I bought Plum Thumb, which is this really pretty dark red. And Taxi, which is this bright yellow. And I don't know about you guys, but I always wanted to see these sprayed out before I bought them. Um, and I could never find them. So if you want me to spray these on like white paper or something and show you what they look like, just leave a comment and I'll be happy to do that. This one is opaque white and I tried this one already and I love it. It's awesome. This one is powder blue, estate green, and passport, which looks black. Hmm. I don't know what color that really is. Let's spray it and find out. Oh, it is black. Is that black? Yeah. Well, it looks different from the inky black, but it's still black. See? That's weird. I wonder why there's two blacks. Okay, so anyway, those are the Mr. Hueys that I got. And then I did get one other small order. And this is from Scrapbooking Made Simple. Let me see if I can show you the title of there. Scrapbookingmadesimple.com. And they had a video the other day that showed how to use, it, it had like tips and tricks on using the Big Shot and the Vagabond. And I learned some stuff that I didn't know. And I use mine on a daily basis for cat scrappiness, but I still learned some stuff that I didn't know. So I ended up buying this um, impressions pad from Sizzix so that I can use embossing, the embossing from like um, Nestabilities. I can use the Nestabilities to cut and then emboss. And I could never do that before. So I bought this impressions pad and then I also got the silicone rubber uh, textures pad. And they were a pretty good price. They were, this one was $5.10 and this one was also five dollars and ten cents. So, and I guess that's at a discount because the price on here says six dollars each. The shipping was a little high. It was seven ninety-five to ship this, and you know this 
really cost probably a dollar sixty four to ship but you know what are you gonna do can't get them at a local store so okay so that is what I wanted to show you I also have something new from cat scrappiness I wanted to show you guys I have these little popsicles and they're made out of cardboard or not cardboard what do you call it um, chipboard they're made out of chipboard and felt and I've got them in a bunch of different colors let me see if I've got any to show you I do so I've got them in red and purple orange and yellow and I'm thinking about doing like a lime green color so anyway I just added those to the store and thought I would share that with you and I think that's it I did add Lydia's flowers so those are new too and oh I do have something else I have some Stampin Up ink pads for sale and they're $2.50 a piece and I have Cajun Craze Pixie Pink and I've stamped them all and they stamp really well so they don't need re-inking or anything Green Galore Orchid Opulence Lovely Lilac Brilliant Blue Gable Green it's like a neon green if you're into neon this is perfect and Glorious Green so they're two dollars and fifty cents a piece and um, they're for sale you can either buy them individually or buy them all together and just pay shipping uh, and I'll just charge you the you know whatever the shipping is I can weigh it on my little scale so if you're interested in these stamp pads just give me a, um, a message or a holler you know send me a message and I'll get right back to you so okay guys thanks for watching that's all I got for today hope you had a good weekend and I'll talk to you soon bye